forthcoming ISGF uh, conference, which is uh, from 2nd to 4th March, our company BRPL, uh, we want to show our plan for smart grid operations. So basically, uh, you know, uh, our company BRPL, which is distributing power in West and uh, South of Delhi to almost 2.7 million consumer. And uh, we have TND losses in the range of 7.2% and our SADI is below four, uh, four hours. Uh, the next step for us is that how we optimize our network, how we can have uh, lower breakdowns, how we can uh, you know uh, enhance the consumer experience and enhance the consumer engagement. And for that, uh, as a phase one, we have started downloading the meter data and using data analytics to know more about the network, to know more about the consumer, to analyze the power quality. Now, as the next step, we are going for the smart metering. Now we feel the smart metering is beyond meter reading or prepaid or billing alone. And there are a lot of objectives which smart meter can address, especially about the unpredictability related to the renewable, unpredictability related to the electrical vehicles, and many more interventions which are uh, required to be addressed. And for that, we need smart metering. So uh, our showcase will be how smart meter can you know address the various objectives of the utility and how we can leverage maximum benefit from the smart metering. So that is the key thing. And apart from that, I in person is also sharing a small uh, presentation or rather a paper, a technical paper about how to validate the smart meters metering system. Uh, please understand the smart meter or rather meter is a product, whereas smart metering is a system. And there is a big difference between product and a system. And uh, uh, and it's a very costly system. And once it is installed, it will last for say 10 years, 12 years and so on. So one has to be very sure so that there is no regret on a later date uh, that the system is not meeting the objective or there are some issues in the system. And for that, the only solution is the validation. So that's one more area uh, which we are showcasing that, you know, how uh, we feel the validation should be done for the smart metering. And we feel it is very crucial. And in fact, before going ahead with the smart metering projects, any utility or even service provider, they should be very sure about uh, their services, their product, their system. And the validation is key for that. So this is what we are planning to share with the rest of the world. You know, because of the enhancement of the expectation of the consumer and other stakeholders. So we have to adopt new technology. We have to have more digitization and digitalization. We need the digitized grids and so on. So what we expect uh, from the conference is uh, about the new technology, which will enable us to have more data, which will enable us to have more alerts and alarms which will enable us how to leverage maximum benefit from the technology and from the data and from the information and uh, automation of the process. So these are the few areas where we are looking for and uh, we hope and we can find some good smart apps also. Uh, as we know, uh, smartphone is useful and is uh, highly adopted because of the smart apps. So we are also expecting and we are looking for some good smart apps for the power distribution companies. And these are the things we are looking for from India Smart Grid Forum, uh, forthcoming conference.